Thank you. Happening right now, firefighters and first responders from across the area are gathering to say goodbye to a Jacksonville firefighter who passed away last week after battling COVID-19. Visitation underway right now on Old St. Augustine Road in Jacksonville, and that's where we find all your sites. Tristan Hardy tonight. Tristan. Anthony, the viewing for Lieutenant Moya is happening right now, and since we've been here, police and firefighters have showed up to pay their respects to the man they describe as the big guy with the big smile. And those who knew Moya say he was the embodiment of what JFRD is all about, being a public servant. And Moya's colleagues say he unselfishly served his community during this pandemic. And Moya's passing is the second death in the line of duty in two months. And David Castleman, the chief of rescue, says Moya was a quiet man, but he had a tremendous impact on their lives. I would say um, pay attention to the little things. Uh, you know, the little things eventually become bigger things. and. It's how you want to be remembered. And how do any of us want to be remembered? And I think that um, Lieutenant Moya left a legacy with the, the person that he was, the way that he treated every patient that he went to. Uh, he treated them like the, they were his own family. Now, Castleman says the department is working on a memorial sign for Station 42. That's where Moya last served. Now, while hearts weigh heavy, Moya's colleagues say he will be missed. Now, there will be prayer at 6 o'clock today, and the viewing is till 8 p.m. And as for the actual funeral, it's tomorrow, same place, St. Joseph's Catholic Church at 11 a.m. tomorrow. But for now, live in Jacksonville, I'm Tristan Hardy, First Coast News on your side.